Donald Trump took the witness stand today in his own defense in the civil defamation trial from writer E. Jean Carroll in New York. Carroll is seeking $10 million in damages for disparaging comments made after a jury found him liable for sexually abusing her. CBS's Errol Barnett was inside the courthouse. Two days after a joyful win in New Hampshire, former President Donald Trump was stone-faced, testifying in his own defense on the witness stand in New York. Judge Lewis Kaplan presided over the previous civil trial in which Trump was found liable for sexual abuse and defamation of writer E. Jean Carroll. And for this trial, he emphasized no testimony could contradict the previous verdict, which left Trump's lawyers with few questions. She's not my type including whether he stood by the deposition in which he declared his innocence. Trump said yes. At one point, Trump said of Carol, quote, she said something I considered a false accusation. The judge ordered the comment stricken from the record. And when Trump said, quote, I just wanted to defend myself, my family, and frankly, the presidency, another objection and instruction to the jury to disregard. Trump's entire testimony lasted only four minutes. And when he said before taking the stand, I don't know who the woman is, Judge Kaplan reprimanded him for interrupting. Exiting the courtroom, Trump was overheard saying, quote, this is not America. Now, jurors return in the morning for closing arguments and could potentially begin deliberations over this possible eight-figure defamation sum by lunchtime Friday. And Donald Trump, who, by the way, was not required to testify and does not have to be here, JB, he says he'll be inside the courtroom Friday as well. Errol Barnett in New York. Thank you, Errol.